Okay, well, after a story like that, I'm going to take you in a slightly different direction. So, I've been watching people. Does anyone here have a smartphone or an iPad connected to the 3G network? Got a few. And we love those things. We've got our apps. We go everywhere with them. You know, some people and go to sleep with them. Um, now, another question. Are you happy with the data that you get over these devices? I'm talking about the cellular data, not the apps, all those cool things, just the data. Anybody not too happy with their data? Everyone. Very good. I'm David Haas, founder and CEO of Velocity, and I'm here with our CTO, Danny, and we've been building cutting edge mobile data solutions and internet platforms for a few years. And we're really glad to have the opportunity to show you our latest development. And what we do is we're going to make the mobile internet really fast, and it comes with a bunch of other perks too. So let's move on to a quick demonstration. So we're going to open up a site here. Um, now this is over the 3G network. We're going to open up NBC. We'll just wait a moment for it to come on board. Now, do you know that the typical page over the 3G network takes up to 30 seconds? It's a long time. Just go ahead, relax, and enjoy that progress bar. You know, just really focus on it. I find that annoying. And cellular performance can be inconsistent and slow. Um, and there are a lot of holes. There are places that we go where things all of a sudden don't work. And we always search for Wi-Fi. And when we travel, we turn off our cellular data. And that's, that's not really great. Oh, I'm glad it finished. We've got 30 seconds here. 37 seconds just to start working. And now I'll show you what we do. And we're going to move on. And before we get into that, I want to say, the common numbers which are acceptable are 10 seconds before people lose focus. Now, we're seeing 30 seconds here. There's something wrong. We've got to do something about it. Let's look at our Velocitize site. What you see is our app. And we're going to open up the same place. Just watch carefully because it goes fast. One, two, three. That's it. Now you can browse. So we're talking about three seconds in term, instead of 37 seconds. That's a huge difference. And this can make using mobile internet a viable solution for a lot of people who had to go and develop apps or had to do other crazy things just to get their data working. Now, this just makes things really fast. And that lets people focus on their own content instead of focusing on the delivery. Now, let's see how we do this. First of all, we've got the content. It all starts with standard content. The content providers have their stuff, and they make it available. Now, we take that, and we add our servers in the middle. We've got a whole bunch of servers out there full of brains of the whole team putting in the algorithms and making sure that those things just keep the users happy. Now, the content providers need the users to be happy and to stay on their sites, and this helps them monetize. So we sit in the middle, and we are network aware. So our servers always think about what goes on in the network, and we're aware of that, and then we don't deliver just over a regular dumb pipe. We're completely aware of what goes on in the network. Second thing is that we're aware of the content. So we can figure out what goes on with the content. And the last thing is we take into account the user's needs and the business needs. Putting those all together with the amazing capabilities of smartphones, the screens, the processors, then we can develop what we've done here and make an amazing product. One last thing that we do is we can even make your content available when the network just completely doesn't work. OK, so let's summarize here. First of all, the opportunity. By 2013, we're expected to have 
one billion smartphones in the world, a billion devices, and 8% of the internet is going to go mobile by 2014. Now that's a lot of data. For content providers, we give you the opportunity to focus on your own things and to give a real compelling experience to people who want to experience your content. And to the end user who just sits there and watches the progress bar, you've got an alternative. Use Velocity. And you're invited up to our booth to come and see it at the end. Uh, we're up there in the corner. Thank you. <laughs>